Good evening, everybody. It's uh, Vindalu and special guest Maz. <laughs> Long time no see. Thanks, Maz, for joining. Yeah, no problem. Actually, I'm bored to death, so with my savior there. So you're gonna do an introduction. Uh, you can do an introduction. Direction. Ah, I'm, I'm gonna ends. check if everything okay, is. Okay, we are here tonight to watch and stream Bob vs Tommy, aka King Dracula, uh, Division Three, semi-final, and the map list is Mesa Blanca, Subtle Fallout, Double Contaminant. Yes, you heard it right, Double Contaminant. Followed by Capitulum. Beautiful map by Nyx, and then another Nyx map. Oh no, it was Alchemist, I think. Or was it? No, Alchemist fixed it, Nyx created it. I think that was how it went. But after that, another Nyx map, Posterity, if we're gonna get there. Uh, the admin of this match is Vigalu, but he refuses to talk. <laughs> Yeah, I'm silent as usual. <laughs> you asked me to help. Uh, down, down. Here we go. Three, two, one, and they're off. Only on the blue team, as you can see for yourself. And what's your prediction for this match, man? I haven't followed Bob and uh, King Dracula. No, me neither. Um, oh, okay. So. No offense to these guys, but I'll, I'm just gonna go with the flow and see what happens. But I'm hoping for a decider. And <laughs> let's just say that the better player wins. Um, I don't know. I have no, no clue who, who that may be. I'm hoping for the side as well for our viewers, but for you, I'm not because you're gonna do the writing, correct? I always yeah. die at the part um, at the double lasers that Boob just passed. Um, seems they are neck and neck. Oh, that was mighty close, and we almost got sliced up there. Oh, really? Yeah. There he goes into the crystal. And King Dracula just entered that same room, so they're pretty much. Neck at neck. Boobies two or three seconds in front. Yeah. Oh, oh. that bar. <laughs> That's the karma bar. <laughs> <laughs> Beware taunting the opponent. And there he goes, riding down the front lip. King Dracula or Tommy not getting crushed as uh, nice there. But he could get Oh, Boob missed the shortcut shot. Let's see if Tommy does it. No. Oh yeah, he misses it. Uh, he hits it. No problem for him. I think he plays normal weapons, but uh, the same should go for Boo. Uh, which clan was he in again? Uh, Boo? Yeah. Multiple. Um, oh, Jala Habibi. I, I think they play Insta. And their normal normal weapons TDM. So he gets another shot at the shot, haha. <laughs> In his second run, now riding the big lift. And Tommy is already at the outside part, now opening the door, going through. He has bad mover luck there. No problem. Taking it slow and steady. Whoa. And so is Bob, really not taking any risk there. Getting all shots, not going for the shot that that you can do in that room. Um. Oh. 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 Where's your aim, mate? I mean, it's no secret that I can't aim, but other people should be able to do so. So 
where he gets to go for a second attempt. Hits it this time. And no problem with the bar. While Bob is already capping if he doesn't get crushed. And this time he... No! Again! He misses it again. Whenever I'm silent, I try to focus on the game and see when when is a good time to switch players. Sure. Oh man, this is so I'm tense. <laughs> oh, Tommy missed the, the first shot of the... to, to get the lift uh, to come up. Yeah, he has fallen behind by quite a bit. Uh, Bob is now about to ride the big lift and reach the outside. Oh man, that was close. I wouldn't have skipped that one, but he does. He has now reached the aforementioned outside part. It's the button. While Tommy is on his heels. Haha. <sighs> <sighs> You know what that is? Uh, it's a grinder. That's <laughs> no. <laughs> no, that's some Ricola. <laughs> Even better. <laughs> oh man, Tommy, so close again. In the first run it was Bob, but now he almost gets sliced up. But hits a shot and enters the crystal room. But I think this first map Mesa Blanca is going to Bob. Only those two blades left that he masters no problem. And this part is really hard to ah. And Tommy is gone. Um, it was at the at the, at the karma bar. <laughs> and oh, Boob decides even, not to hit the shot even. Yeah, his enemy, no problem. And it's a long drive, but victory at the end. And the first map goes to Bob with a two dead. And 215 for Tommy. Um, the two minutes was that this run or his previous one? Because two minutes uh, without using the shortcut is actually quite nice. I'm sorry, um, can you say that again? <laughs> well, did he get that two minute time on his. Second run or on that last run? Uh, oh, um, couldn't say. Ah, couldn't but say. I think he, he hasn't hit the, the target anyway, so. Two minutes flat, that's quite nice a time, and it gets him first map over Tommy or Kim Dracula, whatever you prefer. And now we're going for Drunk Lux. Um, most recent map before Frost. Subtle Fallout. The CB version. Um, viewers, if there's anything wrong with the stream, if it's laggy or if if there's sounds missing or sounds dominating our voices, um, please speak up. Um, do it via PM. Um, and I'll try and fix it. Yeah, Vindaloo, the man in charge, it's not 8 bit quality, so you can tell I'm not streaming. And the countdown has begun, everyone has clicked 6, 5, 4, and so forth. Nobody using the latch strategy of getting over that. First obstacle, which is actually easier, but that's of preference, I guess. And Bob already maintaining a slight lead over two here. I would say five to yeah, maybe five seconds long. Not even five. Goes down the assembly line. The conveyor band, or whatever you want to call it.
Uh, but the, the bounce first attempt, no problem for him. Let's see how Tommy does it. <laughs> that looked as uh, though he didn't know where to go, but... Oh, oh what oh, the hell! lol! What a crucial mistake! So, I think this pretty much seals the second map as well in favor of Bob if he manages to maintain a cool head now. But... He probably doesn't watch the screen, so... He, he might still be trying to rush really hard as he doesn't know where Tommy exactly is. Yeah, do the lamp shortcut. Oh, and he misses the steam bounce. So Bob increasing his lead even further. Oh, going for the lift jump. <laughs> you saw that man? No, no. Bob got the lift jump only but just. Oh, okay. He hit the ledge. Of the edge and oh, to 38 HP only, that would have been his second death. Well, it's pretty much a capping from Boo, it's uh, just a matter of time when um, switching over to Tommy. Yeah, switching the big room now. Fucking steady creeping noise here. And he hits all the targets, Tommy where it is, and goes for the lift jump, slide, no problem. Time is pretty much impossible now. A nice Although feature in that uh, three, sh three shots room would be if you get pressurized, if you don't uh, <laughs> make it too fast uh, enough. Yeah, I saw Sheep uh, getting crushed by that final lift once. But there was a friendly practice match, but it is possible to die here. Uh, um, Boop taking some high voltage, um, so he's down to 40 HP, 40 HP already. Uh, he will have to look out um, at the drop down. So his HP condition is similar to the one he had on his previous run, where he had 38 HP. Uh, meanwhile, Tommy is keeping his first cap. A 4.59 with waiting time, that is. And with, and with the mistake. Whoa, boop! Oh my god, he, sa he saved himself. Nice one. He had to need a second attempt on the vent, on the steam. Um, he could have lost even more HP, but um, his aim saved him. I guess it's good to play instantly once in a while. <laughs> once in a while. <laughs> but then again, this is a shooter game, so even in BT you should have the basic aiming skills. Which a lot of people don't have, me included. But Bob is taking it really safe, not taking any chances at those movers. Oh, he's going for the long dodge. Uh, Tommy had a few deaths at the start. I'm guessing he didn't know about um, that you can jump on the on the edge um, and yeah. then jump over. The yeah, pressure. I was surprised to see that as well. Neither of the player has done that so far. And I think we're good for a second cap by Bob. First cap was a 345, and this one could be a 310, maybe? Uh, what's a good run then? Um, sub, sub two, three minutes? 230, I guess. Yeah, yeah. How to explain that room? Um, well, you have these small crushers on a spike. Um, oh yeah. Oh well, not on a spike, but yeah. Um, the he, 
he tried to do the second one very fast, but um, that didn't out, uh, didn't work out for him. That's bad. Yeah. So he took an unnecessary risk and got punished for it, as he did uh, with health damage for being slow and got just get out. Now. But I'm saying 2.30 is a good time, um, but I don't know how the time is being calculated on these servers. Uh, this is the DP2 timer, so it should be something like 1.1 seconds real time, or 1.15 or something, something like that, if I shall not be mistaken. And Bob again going for that diagonal dodge. I think that's quite risky. Indeed. Like we saw Tommy failing it in his first run, giving away the map kind of. Well, only he knew that he did, but opted to just keep going. So Tommy died here at the second one. Where boobies. Or ball. Yeah, he probably had to rush because he was behind. Let's see how he, he approaches the obstacle now. Oops. No, not this <laughs> But I doubt he had the second cap in before Bob uh, closes the map. With his third, already going up the cliff. No, no problem. Really sketchy on his first run. Almost died at the picture. But this time no problem. And Tommy is just leaving that room. No, oh is he? Oh man. I don't know if that was just me, but that looked super close. Uh, from Tommy's view? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it was just you. <laughs> okay. No problem. <laughs> and here he goes. Could be no problem from here. Unless he crashes and he does not, so includes the second map in his favor. So it's 4 0 2 Bob, a 2 51. Yeah, and Tommy just uh, reminded us of double contaminant, two contaminant in a row. So we're in for quite some. Yeah. And I would say it's the harder maps in Division 3 as it has been in Division 2, the previous one on one cup. A splashy map, if I'm not wrong. A uh, good mapper, splashy. Yeah. He also creates the all time Division 1 favorite Lost Journal, which we saw yesterday uh, in the match Dylan versus Angus. Where Angus put up for a nice fight, in my opinion. As he took black rent off of Dylan. And some premature taunting there <laughs> by Tommy. <laughs> Not sure if just joking. Although he probably is. Or some funny bunny hopping there by Krishi, who didn't know how to cap. Versus loser who just plainly couldn't cap on this map. Oh, they think I'm an admin. Kind of cool. <laughs> I'm not. Yo, <laughs> your trademark. Uh, yeah, true. one liner. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can't do it as good as you. Uh, everyone has their little things, I guess. Ah, uh, no, that's from so far from both players. Uh, that first room can be... Well, can have a mind of its own. Not <laughs> true. But they show that they are familiar with this map, as they both picked it. 
and let's see if there are any differences in it would be really game. impressive if we saw a fence shortcut here I don't, uh, I don't, maybe I don't, Tommy is going for it. I don't think it's worth it. Um, you don't save that much time. Yeah, Tommy seems a little uh, uncomfortable with the map, taking it really, really slow on that one dodge. But could be wrong if he just wants to make sure he just manages that obstacle and it's all good from there. Whoa, boob jumping that. Ooh. There was a funny death in a previous cup here um, that a player, um, I think Freestyler. Um, oh, what the hell? Oh, where, wow. He probably died at the suit. Did you cover that death? No. Oh, oh I did cover this one. Oh, <laughs> oh what the hell? So they both die at the suit. Or at least in that room, and with the advantage to Bob again. Bob, up and Adam. <laughs> there goes. Oh, God. that was close. Up and Adam, is that a Simpsons quote? Um, no, I just picked it up from Left 4 Dead. I think it's just. Come on, everything's fine, get up. But then again, could be now lack in. Oh, I, I do remember McBain saying it. Whatever! Um, Tommy now entering the sign room. I should set my free cam um, in the toxic room. Uh, in the, the toxic suit room. Yeah, do that. That's a really nice feature. We can features for free, no problem. And this time, let's see. Yeah, Bob is taking calls. Whoa! Oh, okay. Whoa! What the? Whoa, what the hell? <laughs> Whoa! Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, some nice Robux in there. Of clearing that room, but there goes the first cap. And it's a 149. And meanwhile. Is at the flags as well, and he's going to level the score at 147, so he's two seconds faster. Um, maybe that puts some pressure on the board when he dies and sees the faster cat time. I do apologize for my girly voice there for that reaction, uh, but <laughs> <laughs> everything outside a, an everyday run. Um, is kind of unusual. Oh, two, two, two. And again, Bob taking a death, so the lead. At the fence, he shot it too, too early. Ah, this gives out some chances for Tommy. Yeah, so we might see it's either after all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's oh, do no. all. Let's do he it. Can't hit. He can't hit the target. That's like. That's an active radius of like 200 something. And yeah, I'm not taking any risk. Although that was still pretty close. The dodge from that lift. And at the meantime, Bob is catching up now, getting out of the same room, but again. Yeah, now I, now I saw what you meant, man. He jumped off that lift instead of dodging. So, got some serious guts to do that. And at the toxic room, at the toxic suit room, he doesn't jump over the bouncer. Um, in, my, in my opinion, that's also tricky. And Tommy is... Having a 2 1 lead now of faster cap time, but Bob is scoring a 139. Ah, pressure so is on Tommy. Yeah, pressure is on Tommy now. He just has to maintain his cool and cap out this map before Bob reaches up to him and overtakes him. But he's already on his heels 
some nice double tapping there going on. Ah, all macros, man. <laughs> oh man, Jesus. Oh. <laughs> Fucking hell. No, swear, no swearing, please. Oh, oh, and Bob is gone. Did you saw that? No, I was just back in common. Damn, damn. I think he died to the fence. Uh, if someone that you wants to join, uh, we could uh, use another spectator so that every uh, flaw gets um, dealt with. Yeah. Where could it have been? Perhaps at the fence. Yeah, let's see. Uh, oh no, he doesn't even manage to get there this time and should have taken his time just like Tommy did on his first run. When I said he seemed uncomfortable, but Tommy is all set and good now for his final capture on this map and first map win. So, score is 4 2. Oh man, it's gonna be exciting to see this map getting played again. <laughs> yeah, true. Actually, the first time. Normally, I'm not I a fan of that. double maps, but this time I'm all up for it. GG. Yeah, totally. So, a GG right there. And the score is 4 2 in favor of Bob, but Tommy taking that map contaminant. And we're going for the round 2 of contaminant. User joined your channel. Yo! Yo. Yo. Hello! Oh! My Dinaid request has cover. been answered. Yeah. Ha -ha. Dinaid made a cover all, all floors for you. <laughs> of course! Yeah, hang on. Yeah, you can yeah. do it. I'm in. What's yeah, going on? Mean. Pretty exciting match so far. Yeah, it's okay. Division 3, but... Hey, usually I Division 3 fight. matches are the most exciting ones. <laughs> well, it's no fun when everyone knows how to play. Yeah, that's that's pretty much true because uh, Division One plays like Division Three. Sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Well, you you know when Dylan just dodges off into nothingness, and you really wonder if it's Division One or Three. <laughs> hey, that's what we're that's what we're watching for. Those type of fails, you know, the, <laughs> the end death grabbing the flag and then just jumping off randomly into slime or stuff like that. That's that's what makes BT exciting. Yeah, it's when you hit the wrong button for your macro, yeah. and something like that happens. Yeah. <laughs> all right, now I can be silent all the time since Supa is here. <laughs> Are you no. saying I talk a lot? <laughs> yeah, no problem. No, no, I didn't mean it like didn't mean it like that. Um, hey, it's it's your stream, Vindaloo. You have to you have to host. You're the host with the most. The more the merrier. So exactly. Bring the bunch. How and could you join if I set the spectators on? to to two? Uh, it, Sets back to three um, once the map changes. Oh, okay. He just hacked that spectator slot, no problem. Yeah. <laughs> so, first time you and me on the stream, right? I think so. For me? Yeah, too bad I'm taking a cannabis pause. So, <laughs> can't be high today. That's, that's not very ah. fun. Wow. Missing the job there, Tommy. And just slides off into the slime. Oh, oh the! Saw that Bob just really, really close on getting that dodge where he died the previous uh, map. Or the previous time that map. That the map gasps played. from uh, are really amazing. Ooh, uh, we need more <laughs> of that. Oh, yeah. What makes PT fun to watch? All the reactions. I mean, you don't get that in CTF or. Deathmatch, you or you do sometimes, but not as often as in BT. And Tommy taking another death there, so he changed his name to Kim Dracula for some odd reason. It's his official nickname. Yeah, the one maybe he, he wants up to remind for. Rob of some ETF matches where he slaughtered his ass just to increase the pressure a little bit more. I don't know, but Rob is definitely going to take the first cat now. Score is 4 to 2, right? Uh, yeah, in favor score is 4 2. Yep. And there goes the first cat with a 3 21. But that includes waiting time. 
So this is the second time we're playing contaminant. Who, whose pick was the first contaminant? Was it Tommy's or was it no, Bob's? Or Bob. Okay, okay. So they could be taking each other's maps here, even though it's the same map. Yeah, let's see how he approaches the dodge. Again, really close, but anxious to get it. We see a lot of players um, that I don't know why that lift doesn't crush in this map. It'd make it a lot more interesting that one where, you, where we saw Tommy just pass where he kind of just stands there and lets it hit him yeah. and then just reset. Yeah, in my opinion it's also much more skillful to just uh, do the long jump before it yeah. and then dodge off it. Yeah, that's, you can do it either way. I mean, oh, oh, and Bob taking a death. Didn't see and it. I've not uh, caught where that happened. Fuck. <laughs> we have three of us and none of us saw where he died. So We need we need another spectator. <laughs> yeah, we, <laughs> we should just get the whole B BT community to spectate that way. <laughs> Someone will eventually capture it. But that actually makes this map a lot more interesting because that gives Tommy the chance to catch up now. He was quite far behind, but now after that death from Bog, he... Uh... Yeah, they're actually neck and neck now. Yeah, exactly. But let's see if the pressure gets to him again with that dodge. I think a lot of people are going to be surprised how well Tommy's playing today. Um, I know from the C bookie that Bob had, I think, 99% of the bets on him, and only Chessy put a bet on Tommy to win. Oh, okay. So I, I think there's 21,000 euros wagered for Bob and only 1,000 for Tommy, so. Well, here I was wondering why Tommy. Uh, can't keep up with Bob, but that actually explains. Again, he's taking his time on that lift, so good luck catching up there, mate. <laughs> and Bob kind of fell off there, but uh, the bouncer saved him, so he's fine. Uh, he was lucky, in my opinion, because sometimes when you fail it, it doesn't bounce you the second time. Oh, really? Oh, I've never yeah. experienced that. Oh, what the hell happened? It happened to me like Oh, he missed the toxic suit, I guess. Damn. I think, yeah, that's probably the hardest part of the map. Um, the kind of the rushy part. Um, it, I even saw some Division 2 players in the last cup failing that, so... Seeing Division 3 players is... And there goes Bob, a 159. Yeah. Come on. I'm not sure if you guys um, are aware, but uh, the cup records are 133 by finals oh, on wow. this map. Uh, just That's... to give everyone a comparison on the times that is possible on this map. That's actually a pretty good time. But it's also worth noting that finals is no longer in the cup, so <laughs> he, he might have 12 of the 15 records, but... He didn't even make playoffs, so... Whoops, my bad. <laughs> That's not the console key. <laughs> oh no, and... Well... But um, that was... Still one more cap to saw. That death from... Did somebody see that? Did for fuck's sake somebody saw that? No. Damn it, <laughs> come on guys! <laughs> I saw it, I saw where he died. Um, I got a lot of bad luck when streaming. I always miss out on the deaths. No, what what happened there was actually Tommy caused Bob to die there. Um, because Tommy, he does that lift. He sits on the lift and waits for his head to crush and it glitched back down. And Bob was just doing the lift jump and Tommy just made the move a glitch as he was going up the lift jump. So the lift jump went straight back down. Like, you know, if you glitch a mover, it kind of resets the other movers in the map. And so oh, yeah. the lift okay. jump was going up, and then it just suddenly went down just as he started to lift jump, and he just basically walked off into the slime. So, um, so the he fact should that... be getting a forfeit loss for backing the map. Yeah, well, as we can see, Bob's doing the same thing with the mover, so both players are doing it, and all the movers in the map would be affected by it. So, can't really. It's hard Ooh. to put a rule, and people should just. I remember that from like 2004 or something when they. Blamed uh, Maverick, so nobody could cap. Yeah, on <laughs> I remember on uh, on the original Maverick on blue, mm -hmm. if you stood underneath the first lift, it'd crush you. On red, it wouldn't, so you could just stand underneath the first lift on red, and no one could be able to cap. 
because you'd just be glitching all the movers in the map. So uh, yeah, we used to do that for hours just to piss people off. And this is the final cap. Yep, with a one fifty-four. So Bob definitely looking good to take the next map, which is uh, Capitolum. Actually quite looking forward to it. Yeah, quite a rushing map. Um, but we have seen a lot of different free players struggle on Capitolum. They, it's one of those maps where you kind of have to be really good at dodging. If you miss yeah. a dodge, you just fall off basically the whole thing and have to start again. So Yeah, you fall down the entire map just yeah. for one little mistake. So this is where stability really counts now. And Kim showed that he can be stable if he just wants to. Uh, when he took contaminant, well, the first one. Tommy was looking good for a while on first round of Contaminant, but I think this one is going to Bob, who just got to be the more stable player throughout the match so far. So there, guys? We are, uh, yeah, I was just <laughs> discussing what happened there with um, I... the death that Bob took, so yeah. And I've got 500 people PMing me on IRC, so you know, sometimes when you're as popular as I am, you know. Yeah, VIP. Yeah, exactly. I think it's been over five minutes since I've said something. Yeah, exactly. Where's Vindaloo? He's <laughs> the one that's hosting the stream. Well, I can't multitask as good as you or as good as any girl. Uh, I need to focus <clears throat> on one thing that's either talk or stream. Can't do both. Can't the main thing is we still drive better than them, so... <laughs> that's... Alright, so we're getting underway on Capitalum here. I don't think we'll see anyone doing the jump around the first door, even though it's pretty easy. Both players doing it legit with Bob oh, already having quite a small lead. Although spawns could have played into that, but I think overall Bob's slightly faster player than Tommy. Although. And also more stable in my opinion. Maybe not overall, but definitely in this match, what we've seen so far. Yeah. Oh, that was really, really close by Kim. Just the room behind now. Ah. Yeah, that room that Tommy's and a lot of players have struggled at. Um, but they have made it easier on this version of the map. In the original capital, um, if you failed that, it takes two hits and you're dead. It takes 80 HP per hit, while in this version it takes like 4 HP or something, so you can kind of idle there for half an hour and still be fine. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted to, to ask, uh, why is it that CB makes the maps more more easy? Um, um, because players are pussies and they can't dodge. Like, why add barrels to decayed collapse or something? It's a <laughs> variety of reasons. Uh, a lot of... Some of the CB fixes have been because there were complaints from, for example, in the Nations Cup from American players who had to play high ping and they couldn't make movers in time on those. So they made the CB version like um, slower timings on the movers, which made it a bit more fair for other players. But a lot of the CB fixes I don't really agree with. A lot of them just make the map really dumbed down. Yeah. I don't think the map needs to be CB fixed unless there's something completely fucked up in it. For example, the don't Rook play. Dodge. Um, that needs a CB because it's like one side is far greater than the other to play on. And that who throws is, out the balance. Who is in charge of the CB fixes? Uh, there's no certain person in charge, but... Um, Usually you just ask the, mapper. the mappers, yeah. Yeah, usually, the way it usually works is, for example, regarding Rook, um, I know that Nin has messaged um, Null 
at Null to see if they could, he could make a fix because I know Null mm. doesn't want anyone fixing his maps unless Sorry it's him. Sorry to interrupt you for a second, but both players with effects in cap time, so this could become very close. Yeah, yeah. even more interesting than we anticipated. We're still going to need to see uh, some bulb fail somewhere, otherwise. Uh, yeah, please do gonna... fail. Uh, oh, and like that! Like this! Wow. <laughs> He's and a fellow countryman. Um, you jinxed him, you totally jinxed him, man. Yeah. <laughs> this time we didn't really jinx him, we kind of asked him to do it and he just did it. So, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> players going with he just complied. request. <laughs> so, now, now pressure's on Tommy. He doesn't know though, that's the thing. In this map, he doesn't know that he's um, in front now. And he could still be rushing to try and make up that... The deficit that he thinks he has, so he could make a mistake. one obstacle left. Yeah, well, unless he does a mermaid here, which would make this very interesting. We have seen mermaid fail Whoa. this. And the shot makes it, grabs good. the flag. Oh, oh. nice one. GG. Well, he floated in midair and man. and even uh, left or right pressed his right movement key, movement key, and uh, just fall down, man. Just fall down. <laughs> Still. Posterity coming up. <laughs> so that's quite a rushy map with <laughs> probably only the end really being a hard part where you can die hard in division 3 standards, I would say. That last dodge at the lava room that can be quite a pain in the ass, but we will see. I'm guessing the next map is Posterity. Mm -hmm. Oh, big by boop. Mm. Or Bob. Yeah. Mm. And I'm not gonna get it in time. No. Or Decade. Oh, that yeah, could be. Uh, let's let, be let them play some Decade <laughs> and just yeah, see that, how it turns could, out. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That could be a good decision. I mean, I, I can't cap Decade. So. <laughs> That's a bit worrying there. Maz being in Division 1, not being yeah, able to yeah. cap Decade. <laughs> <laughs> but I kept Flagrant and I had a lead over Dylan. Two seconds. That's not that's not hard against Dylan and Flagrant. Uh, <laughs> as we saw yesterday, he Flagrant really isn't his strongest map. Ooh. I'm guessing we're going to posterity now. Yeah, you can change. Yeah. So probably the longest map in Division Three. Well, it is the longest map in Division Three, and not really the hardest, but there are a few hard obstacles towards the end of the map, which we have seen cause a lot of deaths and has also basically made the map time out, like go past 20 minutes, so we'll see how these players go. Who picked this, by the way? Uh, Bob. This is a Bob. Sure. Well, yeah. fair enough. I see that Tommy was calling it post, post shitty or something, so doesn't look like he's a fan of this map. Well, let's see how it turns out then. What's the cup record on this map, man? On um, this, I'll take a look. I believe it's a 3 minute 15 by finals. Oh, okay. Which is Fine, a pretty again. decent time. Um, you can. I don't know if either of these players will beat it, but it requires the train shortcut and a few other things. So, I mean, you can do probably like a 310 or something in a cup match, but that's probably the limit of this map. Okay, cool. Uh, I doubt they would rush it, but I think Bob is overall the faster player. Uh, he might, if Tommy takes it up, he might cap 3 before Tommy even gets to cap 2. Uh, Wild Beast commenting, commentating in VT, have you guys thought of the possibility that the contestants go to stream URL and listen? Yeah, that's a, that's a stupid statement to make. Obviously, um, players can do that, but it is against the rules and there's no real way to protect against it so there's no point thinking about it because if you it's really wanted yeah. it's I, I i honestly think i'd be thrown off more if i was listening to the stream yeah i was, I was gonna playing. say it's probably less helpful than listening to it because it just increases the pressure when you know you're in the lead exactly i mean you yeah 
especially since there's like a 10 second delay anyway, so you, I mean, you kind of know where your opponent is, but you don't need that added pressure, and I don't think having my voice or Maz's voice in the back of your head while you're playing a <laughs> BT match is the greatest thing to have, to be completely honest. Yeah, true. I'd, yeah, I'd my beautiful I can see why voice. you didn't mention me, since I'm, I'm muted anyway. <laughs> <laughs> All right, right, and they're getting underway here. Countdown. How come I don't hear the countdown? It adds to the excitement of this match. Um, you should all watch it. So, uh, Bob's on match point, I believe, for this match. I think he's what six yeah. four. Yep. yep. This is yep. This, this is his map pick, and if he loses this, could be uh, quite interesting. And that would that's be the decider, decider right? that Winderloo was hoping for. He's gonna do all the writing. Oh, He's gonna yeah. do all the writing, has to do all the admining, so he has to eliminate maps. So I'm not sure that Winderloo wants a decider anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't go for the second grade? Nope, neither does Tommy. Uh, we've seen a few players kind of try skip the last crate and die there and. Tommy going the wrong way in the maze, but he's fine now. Oh, Such Bob going for the train. Oh my god, man. Wow, that was close. Um, Tommy not going for it. Meanwhile, yeah. so that, that's probably a good pick from Bob, because if he's practiced this, this is one of the maps that's a longer map, and you can shortcut a lot of it and do a pretty quick run, so I think it's a good pick from Bob, especially if he's practiced it really hard. Definitely, and him being the faster player. I don't see him losing unless he makes a really, really stupid mistake at the end where you can... Yeah, well, the bridge, for example. A lot yeah. of players have been caught out at the bridge, the, uh, the broken bridge. Hasn't Finals also lost this one? Uh, he, got I... the, he got the record, but he, I think he lost it. Because yeah, I can't remember, he walked but... off or something. Or maybe yeah. that was the previous cup. No, I know a lot of people have walked off the bridge. A lot of people have just... Um, kind of dodged on top of the bridge and then just walked off and like a bunch of other things like that. So yeah, the bridge has been probably the toughest part of this map for and a lot of players. And Kim the dodge twice now. Did we do it? We saw Thanks, Bob Matt. fail that once as well. Kim, uh, Dracula dodging from pretty far away there. He should be um, dodging close to the edge of that platform, which seems to be his, his problem. Yeah, he makes it with a right dodge. Left dodges for the win. <laughs> I agree, but some players seem to prefer their right dodges. Can't remember which side on this map. Um, one side is bugged in that room that Bob's in right now. Like the entrance to that, you can kind of yeah. get stuck in the wall. Yeah. I can't oh, remember yeah. which team that's. Oh, that, that's. And he's <laughs> gone, man. Oh, what the hell? Uh, what, did, what happened? It kind of seemed close in the first place, but then. He just you... couldn't line up for his jump, and he jumped into the wall and couldn't make it up, and just... Was, was that the um, rising and falling platform? Yeah, yeah, he jumped yeah. way too late, and then he didn't have enough time to line up for the second jump. So there we go. Um, match is in Tommy's hands now. He's got literally a two and a half minute lead now from that late death, so as long as he can get some clean runs in, yeah. he could take this to a decider. And he has just to take it slow and steady. And not die. Wow, he is taking a very And Bob's taking scene. another death. Yep. Alright, here we go. Broken Bridge, the place that kills people's dreams. No problems, ah, no though. Problem. One more tough obstacle, this one. If he jumps from two. Oh, he's fine. He is fine. So, should get his first cap in here. Yeah. Okay, please, somebody spec spec uh, spectate Tommy if, he's, if he fucks up at the end, but I'm not gonna bother since I believe it's a cap in. You have to be really stupid. Uh, yeah, really stupid, really and nervous. Bob is really stupid, but he's not at the end. Um, that's gonna be cap yeah. for Tommy. Taking his time. Oh. A lot in the flag room there. Can't trust that dangerous, dangerous flag fall. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> pretty tough to hit that flag, so... But he manages to do it. Uh, I remember in the... One on one from 2009, I think it was the last World Cup, the uh, Spice won as well. And Anarchist glitched through the flag on. on. Um, what was it? Evolution. Yep. 
Yeah, that was really uh, cool. I think we saw s something like that on. Um, well, Mermaid did the same thing. He kind of, on Capitolum, he basically jumped into the flag and the f the pole that the flag sits on in Capitolum is not a real brush. It's just like, it doesn't exist there. Okay. So he just fell through it and missed the flag completely and died. <laughs> Quite possibly the funniest death I've ever seen in a cup. It was hilarious. Um, and T versus right, Troopy is starting yeah. in five minutes. Yep, head over. If you want to watch that, head over. Oh! To oh! And wow. Come on, can you even cap this map? <laughs> Taking um... the fourth death here. And I would say, compared to Contaminant, this is probably one of the easier maps. In the but division. seeing yeah. as Night Terror will win 6 uh, 8 to 0, uh, you should be watching this stream. Uh, I don't I don't think. I think Stroopy yeah. will at least take one or two maps. Come on. He, he's a feared, so I believe in him to be able to win. Uh, he can pre be pretty decent. Yeah, I, s um, I saw him practicing a bit early. I don't think he's been practicing that much, but I think he has a decent chance if he plays stable. Seems his nerdy days are over, where he just sat on um, FBT 24-7 doing record runs. But record runs and cup matches are two different things and that's true and that proves here as well in my opinion as Bob is the faster player but he's not stable at all in this map and yeah and it, a microphone huge... muted. it's quite interesting because it was his map pick as well so I mean you'd expect him to be more stable microphone activated map, but... yeah and it was the one Tommy was the one who was complaining about how shit this map is before the match, so But let's see if Tommy can play out that uh, powerful card that he has now. Yep, doing probably going to the toughest rooms in the map now. Go. I managed to do the room where Bob died and that was the furthest he got and even that was no problem. No problem. Yeah. Makes nice. the uh, third that looks like second cap going to Tommy. And probably Vindaloo should start getting a list of maps ready that haven't been played because we're going to have to go back to IRC and choose the decider map. Fuck's sake, I'm going to sound so noobish because I don't really know what to do when it's... Yeah, no problem. Uh, if you want. Let me know yeah, the group, if... so no problem. Oh right, Asterix is streaming um, NT vs Trubi, I forgot that. Uh... Yep. Uh, I'm just going to find out the IRC channel that you're in, and so I can prepare Do you already a have a map list for that uh, Night Terror match? Um, I'll take a look. I'll see if his stream is up. Oh, it's pretty really interesting to see which I, I know what Stroppy's picked, because he told me earlier, but I have no idea what Night Terror's picking. I know Stroppy's picking um, Krypton, Lost Journal, and I believe... Um, Decayed, I think. Okay. This is third map. And if not all hell breaks loose for Bob, ooh, that was really close. He gets in his first cap now. Ah, <laughs> lol. He went to the wrong side in the flag room. <laughs> A lot of people do that actually. They think there's some sort of button before the flag or the flags to the left when you walk in, but no, you just go right and it's there. And can Jackal get past the train? So all he has to do, in my opinion, is just get past that lava part in his good for decider. And who would have expected that? Oh, what oh, the hell? Oh, come on! Oh. <laughs> <sighs> no comment. How long do we <laughs> have left? But he still has time? he still has a huge lead. So yeah, and 11 minutes. So hopefully that is enough time. Uh, when to decide, do you flip a coin to see who picks or who um, eliminates the first map? I think so, right? Yeah, okay. I, I um, really thought you could front touch that, that laser. Right? Is it? It should be. Okay. Um, but. Oh! Kim dying again. <laughs> the first is great. Check the rules, I don't know. Sometimes uh, they're different for one on ones or open cups. Yeah, I'm trying to have a look now through the rules.
the clan with the most frags uh, or caps after format. Oh yeah, okay, right, decides. Okay, so yeah, it's whoever has the most caps so far. And now uh, the death spree is on beginning. Yeah. yeah, see his flow is off from that one that one f dodge. Uh, and it's the pressure it's really on him weird that you increase. can't front dodge that laser. Um, I, yeah. I thought so. It was possible. Can, but you probably have to hold walk and kind of walk up against it and get the full. I'm front excited dodge. to see how he copes with uh, the increase of pressure when Bob manages to get the second cap in. Yeah, especially since or if... I mean this match is still wide open because if yeah if Tommy gets to the uh, lava room yeah. uh, near the end he could die and they'll just throw the match completely in. Uh, Bob's favor because uh, Bob uh, definitely has to cap gold. Yeah, Cap will definitely put the pressure on Tommy. And let's see, he's definitely another part now. Uh, this time, not dropping at all. Time for the uh, bridge though. No problems. Nice one. Whoa! Oh, no! Oh! No! No! <laughs> that. Oh man. Oh, That's this stream, you should watch it. Watch it right now. Even if you don't play this game, you should watch it. Yeah. Tommy, once again, <laughs> going for the front flip at the laser. Um, this and, oh, I see. It, just, it is yeah, possible. This time he just made it. Yeah, he just made it, but it looked very close once again. Yeah. Don't know why you want to do the same uh, on your... when it failed before. You want to do, try and do it again, uh -huh. just to prove your your uh, your wrong that it can be done. But uh. that's just regular human stupidity, I guess. <laughs> Humans always making the same mistakes. Well, stubbornness, I guess. <laughs> no, I can do it with the front dodge. I will do it with the front dodge. This time. Um. Does anyone actually? Oh! oh! Splat! Bob dying again. So that's a total of six deaths, I think. Yeah, correct. It's rather easy map. And this is his own map as well. Oh my god, every comeback from uh, Kim Dracula. 6 to 2 down, well, uh, to 6 to 6. Tied up. It's actually going to be quite interesting. Um, currently, before posterity, um, Bob has a two cap advantage over Kim Dracula. Yeah. So if it comes down to whoever picks whoever eliminates first, if Bob could get one more cap in, then he would. But if uh, Tommy caps here, then I think we're going to a flip of a coin because both players would have have the same amount of caps over the first five maps. Nice. Right, but then the question is, who gets to call it? I think it's the one who won the first map. Yeah. Okay. So we'll do that, and then they get to decide whether um, Bob eliminates first or they eliminate first. Don't call it too early, yes! Oh man, <laughs> I so saw, saw it coming when he failed it at first. <laughs> oh man. Seven minutes remaining. And Seven will this map remaining. even be kept out? That's the question. Yep. <laughs> Hopefully Bob just caps here so we don't have to do flipping coins and all that bullshit. I don't have time for that. Let's see where he is. Alright. So the lava part that he's struggled with so hard is still to come. Definitely the game breaker here. Kinda of surprising he died so often because he he actually looks quite comfortable. Yeah he does, he looks like looks pretty quick on this map yeah. and all that, but yeah. Maybe just not at the end. And the hardest part to come right here. Oh yeah, no problem. No but problems. Is it one of those dodges that you have to make first attempt or no. no, no, you can but play a it, lot of, but... A lot of people have a problem straight dodging, and if you don't straight <laughs> dodge that, um, you just go flying off into the lava. If you straight <laughs> dodge and don't make it, you land on the top, you can just go down and try it again, so...
so close on these last jumps. And he gets the cap in. Really 17. Okay, so all eyes on Tommy now. Big Hakim Dracula. Still having a two minute lead. And Boop st still can. Uh, well, he wins with an with a tie, or and he can still get a cap in. Yeah, true. Um, It'd actually be pretty funny to see a tie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> was was there a tie in this cup? In uh, as in, like, are you talking time, about like, time wow. running out with uh, equal captures? Ah, uh, yeah, that has been. Yeah. Okay. And Kim not knowing where to go for a split second, but I was not taking more deaths. So this should be the confidence boost that Kim needs to complete this map in his favor. But it can all shatter in the lava part. Also, I just want to point out that the Night Terror vs. Droppy game is going to start shortly, so head over to the Asterix stream if you're interested in that much. But I don't know why you would be when you have a nail biter like this do three match. <laughs> yeah. Oh. oh, oh. At least he didn't die. Yeah. So yet. He, yet. <laughs> but the problem is, one, oh, he's fine. Ah, he's he fine. Needs it. One more. Oh, yeah, he'll wow. do that again. Ah. You can tell he's nervous. Oh. He is yeah, definitely his nervous. His balls yeah. have shrunk to the size of raisins snow. Yo! He is fine. Um, I've already organized the map list for elimination, so. Nice. Good thing we have Super here. Yeah. Of Good thing I haven't smoked my joint yet because fucking I would have been not capable of any of this in about half an hour. And we are going to a decider. Whoa! Nice! Uh, great job so far this cup, man. You and your team. Been very supportive. I think we still have a 100% broadcast ratio. Oh, is there any way I can, um... Bring my IRC, uh, you can if you well, in open broadcaster add a scene and select a program like program caption that you can select IRC. Actually, on your thing, just drag the IRC over your UT client. Yeah, indeed, that's what because, I'm gonna do. Yep. Uh, what what are you casting with these days? Just Which... uh, okay, okay. Um gonna mute myself so I can organize this. Alright. Oh, fuck's sake. But are you still using XBET or what's the program? Uh, we use Open with? Broadcaster. Okay. because I couldn't hear you.
what would be a good decider map mm. Blitz Castle or As you're still here? He went to take a piss. Okay, okay. Right, I'm right, back. So we're down to three maps. It's either going to be Blitz Castle, Storm Surge, or Rush. Which one would you like to see the most? Um, probably Blitz Castle, actually. Yeah, I said that too. Mm. Uh, going <laughs> for it. So, Rush was eliminated. Yep, so here we go, get to the side. Um, I think it's gonna be ball. Blitz Castle. I hope it's gonna be Blitz Castle because Storm Search is pretty boring, in my opinion. Yep, it's Blitz Castle. <laughs> nice! For Blitzy's Castle, up next. It's still Bob versus Tommy, aka Tim Dracula. Position 3 semi final. Oh man, good decider. Yeah, thanks, super. That's right. Um, so, do we have a map list for the Night Terror match? Um, I do have the stream up. It is um, Abydos, first map, which was Night Terror's um, pick. Then you've got Lost General, Krypton, which are both Stroppy's picks. Lethal Sun and Solar Moon are the other two maps from Night Terror. And Decay Collapses, Stroppy's final pick. Whoa, good maps there. Yep. And T going seeing... for the longer ones. And uh, Stroppy. Uh, lots, of rush, lots of rushy maps. Krypton, Decay. I, I expected, I expected Stroppy to pick the rushy maps. Um, I'm surprised Night Terror. Uh, I'm half surprised Night Terror picked Abydos, but. Stroppy's in the lead currently in Abydos, so. Probably just good memories versus Ice Boys on Abydos that made yeah, him exactly. pick that. <laughs> yep. Winning that on first week, I believe, of this cup. Yeah. Um, the server's still the same, right? Or... Yep. Uh, um, I know Tommy's taking a piss or something. Ah, he's online now. Wow. Um, it was 3 to 2 on posterity. Mm. Uh, yep, 3 to 2. Maybe you can log in and uh, force map change. Yep, like now right. we are on Nightmare. Oh yeah, it should be on redirect, but it's fine, I'll change it anyway. Templar Mare, cool map. Except for the kinda luck dodge near the end. And the bugs that can kill you. Yeah. yeah. Worth updating that Stroppy died at the end of Abydos, and now Night Terror has the lead in that game. Pretty yeah. satisfying when GP and E bet Templar and his brother on his own map. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, trying to Blitz Castle. Looking for Bob. Yep. So, what are your predictions for this decider? I Who think is... Bob is definitely capable of taking a few stupid deaths here and there. <laughs> so, it's kind of hard to tell, but. Well, if Tommy wins this, it's going to be an upset in the Sea Bookie uh, world because. Definitely. Only, I think about 20 people. 20, 25 people bet on Bob and one. Yeah, on... me too. <laughs> but then again, uh, I also bet on Salva. Yeah. Uh, uh, on, no, on on Nettles. Yeah, so did I. Earlier. <laughs> yeah, I yeah. bet on Nettles and I bet on um, on Bob yes. and I bet on Stroppy, so I could have a three-way loss here. 
Are you still le leading the people key? Yeah, I am for now. Uh, I'm not sure after today how today's gone so far. Turn is Are we always... both ready, by the way? Pern is always on the hits. <laughs> yeah, Pern's always complaining about not getting his uh, the bookie bets on. So I'm just waiting for the clicky to click. Well, uh, back to predictions that you asked of us. Um, I think Bob is gonna maintain his cool and win this. Fair but enough. Well, he's lost the last three maps. Yeah, um, that could be. It was. Uh, yeah, it went. Yeah, okay. So it went. F he went. He won the first two, lost the third, won the fourth, and then lost the fifth and sixth. So he's only lost one. Yeah, like oh, that. And he takes the first death by getting crushed. This isn't one of those maps that you can die a lot of places on. Um, I don't. I mean, you can fail a few rooms, but I mean, you can die in a few rooms, but yeah, I think you can you can die everywhere, but it's, when you it's know hard. how to play this map, you yeah. just don't. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It's not that hard to avoid the deaths on this map. Maybe at the end, some stupid jumping at those movers. I only saw a couple of people take deaths there. Although I forgot who it was. And Kim taking it really safe at the chessboard. Yeah, going, a lot of people go that weird way. I don't understand why they go to the left and dodge over the statue, but that's all personal preference, I guess. This slicer here, the double slicer. You can just, you can just zigzag, right? Ooh. Whoa, 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 Holy Christ. shit. What's he doing? Oh, lol. He was Looked like he was to... going AFK. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and that has given Bob the chance to catch up, but he still has the double slice to do as well. Epic save there from Kim. Epic wow. save. I'm I'm surprised he didn't get insta killed by the slicer actually. Yeah. And now All for things... the crushes. Yeah. Where you can get stuck in the stairs. Yeah, there's a good technique for doing it. You run on the very outside of it and you have no issues really well. <laughs> this is where this is where a lot of time can be lost and gained as well. If you're behind, if you can do these stairs fluently, then you can gain a lot of time. But yeah, I didn't even know that you could just avoid the back by Yeah, if you outside. Yeah, if you run on the outside of the um, stairs and then you cut onto the inside when there's no crushes, then you go back onto the outside wherever there's crushes and it works fine. Looks like Kim is getting in his first step. Yep, hits the shot late, but well, almost goes into the <laughs> teleporter without the flag. A very sketchy there at the end, but uh, just to see, caps um, Bob grabs. So not much in this, given that Bob did get crushed quite and early in this. Two thirty-eight is. Ah, uh, and Kim gets a good mover timing. Yeah, and yeah, that's what's going to separate a lot of this map. It also brings together a lot of the map as well. If you're behind, if the other person gets bad mover timing on this first mover, it can even things up quite quickly. A um, totally useless laser obstacle. Yeah. That can't even kill you. Unless that's you like fine. land on it, which I usually do. Just fall down <laughs> randomly and always land on top of it. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, oh no, he does not get out in time. And <laughs> wow, advantage is in Tommy's favor here. Wow, looking very sketchy on the chessboard, or checkers board, whichever you prefer, but he gets through. So right. that death from Bob really puts this game in Tommy's hands. And Chessy the Prophet seems like she could uh, have another prediction correct. This cup, she's pretty much been spot on with all of her predictions. Haha, <laughs> this slicer! <laughs> oh, what the hell? Uh, yeah, they were trolling him. Oh, Isn't Chessy an animal caretaker? Maybe he chilled with that uh, octopus that could predict the yeah, Euro Cup. Yep. Yeah, I, well, I know it did it in the World Cup. I don't know. Whoa! Oh! What wow. the hell? 
Ah, he wow. dodged too short. Uh, unfortunate for him. So there maybe goes Chessie's prediction for a yeah, while. Yeah, maybe she, maybe she <laughs> didn't hang out with the octopus after all. <laughs> wow. And just an update for those of you listening to this commentary and wanting to know up the updates of the Div 1 game that's going on currently. Um, Night Terror has won Abydos 3-0 to zero against Stroppy. Lol. Ouch. Nice. I know that Stroppy had 1,900 ping for some of that <laughs> game, so I'm sure that didn't help his uh, woes, but we'll see as they're going into Stroppy's maps now. And Bob managed to master the part that Kim died at. Yeah. Without well. going for second last room, if he doesn't get crushed. Ooh, yeah. he, he gets stuck, but... Yeah, it's because he's, he's running in the middle of the stairs. If he runs on the outside, it would be no problem. Yeah. Yeah, he seems not to know about it. Yeah. Wow, rushing those crushes, I mean, not really required, I and mean, you don't... I mean, if I was a Div 3 player, I probably wouldn't trust my ability that much to rush through these crushes. Especially when you're... Wow! Oh, wow. man! Wow. That was <laughs> so close. But he's cool, and... He's yeah, cool, gets... calm, collected. Yeah. And gets a second cap, so we're at cap point here for and Bob. even the faster time of 2.33. Oh, that's almost impressive. <laughs> <laughs> He's haunting <laughs> prematurely. Almost impressive. I like that. For what it's worth, the cup record on the oh! is at 2.20 by finals. Yeah, that's insane. Although, I, it's I, actually, to be honest, I think if you. The world record in BT time is like a two minute flight on this. Wow! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Wow. Oh! oh. No. <laughs> that, that is quite a stupid mistake to make, if you ask me. Um, yeah. That Papa was not Nubich. required to rush that. Yeah, you, he tried to rush it and it didn't work out for him. He basically lost this match now because of that. If he got a cap in, he would have put the pressure on Bob. There's plenty of places for him to die still, like the double slices. Um, so many places for Bob still to die. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and overall, the most deaths ha usually happen uh, when people tr just try to rush. And... Exactly, and if yeah. you... Yeah, and if you... Um, if you put the pressure on Bob by getting a cap in, then he's more likely to try rush and like get the cap in while well, now he knows that he's got a whole cap lead and basically got this match in the bag now. Uh, let's see how it plays out for him. Him now being the laser room while Bob is falling down. No problem. That was one of the last really difficult obstacles. Yeah, as long as he doesn't rest. get stuck. As long as he doesn't get stuck on these stairs in the middle of a crusher, then... And even, uh, even a dodge block at the end would not be too that harming, or... Let's see if he does not can. Alright. Not rushing at this time. <laughs> it would have failed so badly. Oh! oh. Wow. <laughs> It seems to be hard for him to find the balance between rushing and being too yeah. slow. <laughs> <laughs> but but looks like this is over, and C Bookie is not taking all of our money as Bob has won. Whoa! I'm lucky. Kim could have taken this on numerous occasions, but he just wasted his chances. Very well played by both players here, especially yeah. Tommy, who managed to come back from four 0 down to take this into a decider. Yeah, very well played. Very close, I don't think anyone expected it to be this close. Everyone thought that Bob would just steamroll this game and it kind of looked like it from the first two maps, but um, Tommy pulled his, pulled his shit together and... Tommy needed, Tommy needed your presence, man. Exactly. As soon as he, you he came in, his me. form increased by 100%. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he had plus two stability after I joined, so... <laughs> there you go. So well, congratulations let's just there. head over to the to the other stream then. <laughs> so I'm gonna yeah I'm gonna depart you guys so I can go watch the um, stroppy game now. So 
Thanks for streaming Vindaloo and yeah, likewise. Doing everything. And yeah, thanks for commentating with us guys and I'll talk to you guys at some point in the future. Right cool. oh Peace man. Catch you later man. User left your channel. <sighs> Whoa. Didn't see that one coming. I was hoping for a decider but uh, quite nice. <sighs> quite nice turn of events. Oh, too bad Gim didn't won. They didn't win. You would you say the better player one? Like Boob one or um Uh judging from his performance? No. Not really. I think they were pretty much on par and it could have gone either way. But at the end Kim just didn't manage to stay deathless on Blitz Castle. And well he could have won. Uh, Kim looked shaky on on most of the maps, bumping in into true, true. to some yeah, some I think walls Bob or whatever. Is more skillful. Uh, could be in the nerves. Uh, well, this is a semi-final. Let's not forget. Uh, close to taking home the title, so the nerves are present. You can't deny that. Um, and face having uh, in the back of your head facing a. Uh, what you believe is a stronger and faster opponent um, no. either you are you put you put strength out of that or you get discouraged by that um, yeah true yeah, I don't know um, Bob just didn't manage to yeah use his uh, skill or speed advantage yeah to his advantage <laughs> well, at least not on all maps. Um, he was really, really bad on austerity. Although, he could have caught up had Kim continued to fail like he did for his third cap. For a conclusion, we can say that this game delivered. It fucking delivered. Um, and even Division 1 matches, no offense, can be exciting, um, as this one tonight showed. Um, um, this this match has been a great, um, uh, not tribute, but um, uh, <laughs> can't can't come up with the word. Uh, right, I'm watching <laughs> the other stream now. Yeah, let's do that. Let's uh, end this one and uh, yeah. let's over, let's switch over to Asterix. Um, it's switch.tv forward slash slash Asterix UT uh, yeah. for a Division One match. Um, Go check we, it out. Yeah, I'd like to thank Maz and uh, Late Supa, and of course both of these players for performing a really good game tonight. Um, unfortunately, only one has has uh, gone through or uh, allows uh, advances to the to the finals that being a uh, fellow countryman boob or bob um, congratulations and <laughs> we will see him in the finals very shortly um, has any shout outs any shout outs uh, well no thanks to super for commentating with us it was actually quite nice and yeah Enjoy the Division 1 map match, Loki vs. Night Terror on Asterix Stream. Peace! I have a small short out, sh short out, sh shout out to uh, Ice Boys and uh, Roger Dodger. <laughs> <laughs> I'm signing off now. Goodbye, everybody. Peace!